Good official morning, y'all. Well, really, it's good official afternoon because it is 1.16 and um, I'm now getting up and making breakfast. But anyways, um, I have decided I am going to make fried egg over hard, basically. And then I got my coffee. So yeah, I am going to make my breakfast and then I want to chit chat with you guys. And I was like, you know what? I've been watching so many vlogs. Like I've always said that I've wanted, okay, sorry. I don't want y'all to see me without no vlog. Okay, maybe this is a good spot. But anyways, I always said that I wanted to, um, what's it called? I always wanted to vlog, but like, but I feel like vlogging is just, you know, mad work. But I'll be back. Let me finish my food and we'll come back properly. I know I look crazy, but like, this is how I actually wake up. <laughs> Bye. Listen, I got my bunun, aka fried plantain, aka tostones, aka platano, wh whatever you want to call this, y'all. Okay, I'm Haitian, so we call it fried bunun. Bunun busy, whatever. Anyways, that's my fried egg. It looks a little dark because I have some bacon bites in there. But y'all, that's he made some pickles and <laughs> if you know me <laughs> you know pickles is my middle name any excuse oh my god like why would you make all this pickles knowing damn well this is gonna be gone in a month you see how much i'm putting on there with my lad aka i'm sick <laughs> for this for this pickles oh my god okay i think that's enough and this is my breakfast because i tried to find any excuse to <laughs> eat this pickles. So, yeah, <laughs> I will be back. <laughs> Tear this thing up. So, I ordered some products from Amazon. So I'm just waiting for that to come through. I'm super excited because I am trying some new products that I've seen other people talk about as well as my cousin talked about I think it's the Blueberry Bliss um, product. I don't know if it's a paste or whatever. We'll we'll get back to it and I'll tell you exactly what it is. But um, sorry, my face all up in here. But yeah, so I'm excited to try that out. So once these those items come through, we'll talk about it. Okay. All right, guys. So sorry, I already had took some out of my Amazon bag that I just got. But these are the three items that i just bought i got the as i am dry and inch scalp care oil treatment so i am excited to try this oil and this has olive and tea tree oil and then my cousin anika shout out to you sis she's always been telling me how good this blueberry bliss curl control paste is so I'm definitely going to try this out. She said she uses this um, to retwist her hair, to lay her edges down, whatever, all of that, all of the above. So for my nine month lock free twist, which is, I believe next week, <laughs> I will be using all these items actually. And then I wanted to try this, which is the Rose Water and Peppermint Daily Moisturizing and Refreshing Spray. So yeah, I'm super excited to try these items for you guys. Hopefully they work for my hair because you know, it might work for somebody but it may not work for you type gig. So I just want to know like, I think I paid like $9.99 or something for this. And like, do you see my hand? Like, look, look how small this jar is. Like, and I'm heavy handed. So hopefully it's good. I will keep you guys updated. I also want to tell you guys like, yo, I haven't done anything to my hair since I did that um, perm rod set and like the curls in my hair, like it's still curly in certain areas. And I just wanted to show you guys that like, honestly, the curl, like the actual curls from your perm rod set, if you have locks, they just like last forever. Some of these curls are like, sis, we ain't going nowhere. We ain't going nowhere. I did want to tell you, I did spray some of this in my roots 
in my scalp. And when I tell you my hair feels really soft, just off rip, my hair feels really soft and not as dry. And I know I made that video and I'll go ahead and post it up here somewhere. But I made that video where I was telling you guys that I'm no longer gonna be spraying my hair with water and I'm not gonna be doing these certain things. But honestly, that was like post summer and like summertime, I'm sorry, my hair, especially before I put this on and I'm not even trying to like advertise this cause I literally just tried it for the first time. So, but I will say just after putting this, I could tell how soft my hair is and just how not dry it is. My hair has been dry, like burlo pad dry. And that happens usually after I wash my hair. And I've been noticing, especially because of the, I don't know. I'm, I'm just happy that I have this product. Um, and hopefully it really works out because like I, would t like I was just saying, like my hair is just, my roots were just really, really dry. Like, and like, they just felt like, brittle like super super brittle and i just was like i'm gonna have to take that back i'm gonna have to take that back because i'm sorry i gotta keep it real with y'all my hair was dry as a brillo pad like i cannot be walking around here and i already told you guys that i'm retwisting my hair every other month so this is the this, i'm in the time where i haven't retwisted i just washed it and like after i washed it i just put like oil in my roots and yeah, mm -mm. I definitely, I'm sorry, I have to use a moisturizer. It's the truth, it's the truth. So definitely take that back. That was post summer that I was saying that cause it was working for me when it wasn't that hot. But like I live in Florida and it's hot as Hades here. I'm sorry, it is hot, okay? And I just can't be walking. And the thing is like, I'm not even going nowhere. I'm staying in my house and yet my scalp is drier than dry. Like, you could cut your fingernails on my hair. But, um, yeah, my hair just, it already feels better just from that spray. Like, when I tell you, shout out to me for seeing this on Amazon and just going for it. I like it so far. And I'm happy because I wanted something that was rose water and I'm happy that it's peppermint. So that hopefully that should help me from my oh excuse me from my um my scalp itching like no nah, man we can't be doing that we can't be doing that i need to get ready because me and my aunt and my cousin and my child and my little cousin we are all going to the supermarket we need to go buy some stuff buy some you know groceries or whatever and i have some tilapia that i have um that i need to marinate and stuff but i don't know like i definitely want to get to a point where i am i want to get back to like meal prepping and just like eating healthy because like number one i don't have a healthy relationship with eating food like there's just days where i eat when i'm supposed to and there's days where i just eat one thing two things and i'm like no I need to eat more vegetables. I need to eat more um, fruit. And yeah, and I just need to change up my, the food that I eat. I'm eating the same thing over and over again and just everything I keep just throwing it in the air fryer and I should not be throwing everything in the air fryer. Like I need to bake some things. Like I need, you know, I need to step it up. I need to step up my game. So like I said, I got some tilapia. When I'm ready to marinate and cook that and do all that other stuff, I will be back on camera. I'm low-key pissed that I don't have no dang Creole seasoning, y'all. Like, I'm going to go to the grocery store soon, but, like, I should have the Creole seasoning now. Like, I'm pissed. But anyways. <laughs>
Ooh, this is bright. Ooh. <laughs> but um, okay, I, you just saw me record. Um, see, I'm getting new to this like vlog thing, so bear with me, guys. Like, I'm gonna get better at this. But until then, this is what y'all get. So, anyways. <laughs> Just finished marinating those tilapias. I'm getting ready to take a shower. Let me go and it'd be great if I can get my freaking stuff for my hair and my towel and actually <laughs> take a shower. Hold on. You know, I keep forgetting that you can actually just listen to me. Like, it's weird. Like, going from hair videos and then deciding to do a vlog mad randomly. I don't know. I've been watching so many vlogs and I'm like, you know what? I can incorporate a vlog here and there. Like, I definitely want to get your opinion. Um, also, by the way, before I even um, go in with that, hold up. I want to show you guys... Um, I did wash my face. I washed my face in the shower. So I used a Hydro Boost um, hydrating cleansing gel by Neutrogena. I'm gonna try to get me a sponsor. Let me stop. <laughs> I just wanted to show y'all. I already washed my face when I was taking a shower, but this is usually what I do next. And I'm trying to get better at this, like using my toner every day, but I'll be lying if I told you that I do, I use my toner every day. I, um, I feel like it's like every other day, sometimes not even that. And I usually go back in the back of my ears too and bring it all the way down to my neck. Let me, let me fix this for y'all. Cause clearly, <laughs> oh, there we go. Okay. So I usually pull it down my neck all the way here and behind my ears. There you go. This thing is mad. Nah, I'm too embarrassed. I'm not gonna show you how dirty it is. <laughs> but that just goes to show you that you should be using probably toner to clean up your skin. And this one is pretty good because it's the Dickinson's and it has, it's witch hazel hydrating toner with rose water. And as you can see, I've used a good amount of it. I really like it. I feel like it, I'm trying to remember what was the other toner that I used, but I don't know. This seems to be where it's at. This is the lotion I'm gonna use. I really want a oil. Oh, Fifi, I know you're gonna be watching this. Can you write down the oil that you be always telling me to use? And um, viewers, please write down if there is an oil that you use on your face that you really love, please write down write that down in the comments below because I'm always forgetting to get one. Like my cousin told me like a million times and I still, I feel like it's, hold up, it might be in my Amazon cart. I'm gonna text her, I'm gonna text you with it. And, but yeah, I still wanna know what you guys think. And I just put this on my face, on my neck. You know, and just rub that all in, get that all in everywhere. Ooh. Uh, oh, yeah. So this is what I usually do. But yeah, if you guys have any, um, what's it called? What the? I think that was a piece of the cotton round. But um, if you guys have any suggestions please leave them down below um i have very dry skin um so if you have dry skin as well and if there's a product okay i feel like this never happens so i don't know why these cotton rounds is acting up right now because it don't be happy i swear to you they don't be pieces of cotton rounds all over my face but for some reason these cotton rounds trying to show out okay so, gots to get me the ultimate. Listen, am I the only one that just stay be getting the ultimate Caesar? Uh -huh. This is like next. This ends next mm, week. I don't know. Me and my aunt be trying to eat a lot of salad. So, should I get both? She be liking this American blend and 
I guess I can get the American blend. It's a little bit later than the other one, so why not? All right, Leo. I wanted to get some asparagus, but I don't see it. Does this asparagus look good, y'all? I, I don't know. I haven't bought this in so long. Oh, here's some asparagus in the bag. Yeah, I'm glad I didn't choose those because these look definitely better than the ones that I was going to get. Yeah, I like these better. Okay, we're gonna go with these. No, yeah, I'm gonna have to talk about that on the video because like, okay, so me and my cousin and my little cousins and my and my son come into this, to the supermarket. Homie, first of all, he already was all up on my cousin while she's just trying to walk in. Like he slowed down and wanted us to walk in front of him. Weird, right? So we're passing, going to the produce section, and he looks at me and he's like, oh, you look Haitian. And I'm like, okay, I am. But my cousin's like, but what does a Haitian look like? And I'm like, exactly. First of all, homeboy, all you did was look at my butt. So my butt tells you that I'm Haitian. I'm good. I'm glad that you, I'm glad that you can tell that I'm a Haitian. Like, what's wrong with this man? Like, but they respect him, okay? Sussy de vom. That's what I wanted to tell him. Huh? Yes, <laughs> my cousin said that's a Win Dixie for y'all. So I'm thinking about making some buffalo chicken wraps, and I also wanted to do some jerk chicken. Come on, Papi. We only what? We only been in this area. I know. We're gonna move around, Papi. I always hear about the kombucha. Have you have you tried that? The kombucha, kombucha? I don't even know how to say it. I'm like, what's what, what what's the like hype about it? Cause I always hear about the kombucha, however you say it. But like, is it good? I don't know. You could definitely tell that um, I ain't used to um going like vlogging while I'm. I ain't used to vlogging. Period. Because. I bought all this stuff and I ain't even show y'all none of it, but that's okay. Yeah. All right, I'm getting out of here because definitely spent. We ain't, we, ain't, we ain't gonna talk about that. I'll just show you the receipt later if I do. Because, oof. The way this line is set up right now and like there ain't. Oh, okay. Thank you. Do you want to go, go first? You sure? Oh, thank you. Because I'm talking to Amanda. I'm like, girl, there's a bear. And she's like, where? <laughs> but there was a car behind us. Yo, and then the bear across the street. I'm like, and the bear knows how to cross right. the street. Waiting for the, for the cars. Yo. I told you they are not fun. <laughs> so here is all the groceries. Let me go ahead and um show y'all what I got. I'm laughing because I did stole some soda from my uncle's house. So, Uncle Ching, if you're watching this, <laughs> I done jacked it from your house. But anyways, tomorrow I decided I'm going to make some buffalo chicken wraps. So, I got some of this. This is a um, spinach wrap. Garden spinach herb. And then I got some chicken breast. I also have... Where's the buffalo sauce? Oh, here. I got some sweet baby rays buffalo sauce. And I also got this one too. So I don't know if I'm going to mix it together or just, I don't know. We'll see tomorrow. Um, and then I also got some chicken wings because I have been fiending for some jerk chicken. Like, Feenin, this is the jerk seasoning that I use. Like, you can't go wrong with this seasoning. Like, this marinade, I don't know how you say it in English. Um, marinade, whatever. Be hitting, like hitting. Also, y'all saw earlier that I did not have Creole seasoning. Definitely bought two of these Creole seasonings. And then, have you guys tried lemon pepper um seasoning? Because I've never actually got it myself. I've tried lemon pepper food before. Maybe like once or twice, but I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna definitely try the lemon pepper seasoning one. I don't know. But then I also saw this and I was like, hmm, season seafood seasoning creole blend. I was like, hmm, you know, I can't go wrong. We'll see, we'll see. 
But you know what was the best buy? I'm not even gonna lie. I'm not even gonna hold you guys. The best buy was this, cause like, do you see? No, let me give you my elbow, so you can see how big this thing is. But this size on was originally six ninety nine, but on sale for four ninety nine, y'all. And like, yo, love me some sazon. Like, listen, sazon adobo. Let me show you the adobo. Where the adobo? Listen, this adobo and the Creole seasoning. Listen, if you got them three things in your house, you can live for the rest of your life. You know, I am going to go ahead and put all this stuff away. So, yeah. that was a whole bunch of work y'all but i'm glad we got that done i am going to start my tilapia which let me go grab i got my tilapia i'm gonna cook my asparagus i'm gonna get to work on that so catch me in a second Listen, if you haven't already, you really need to. This everyday strength nonstick, food won't stick. Yo, they're not lying. They not lying. Cause like at this point, why are you buying aluminum foil if it's still gonna stick to your aluminum foil? Don't make no sense. But this bad boy right here, <laughs> y'all about to see. Y'all about to see. All right, y'all. So I got my, what's this thing called again? Tilapia. <laughs> my garlic parm. Um, I don't know if it's just me, but sis needs a little bit more parmesan on here. Okay, that looks a little bit better. So put the oven on 425. The asparagus is going to take, I think, eight minutes, is it? And then my tilapia shouldn't take long, about 10 to 12 minutes. I will be checking up on both of them. And I want to make sure I put my alarm on. And I'm going to be stocking them through this. So I'm going to go ahead and preheat this um, air fryer. Because I'm going to cook my tostones, my bunun, fried plantains, whatever you want to call this. There's still a little ice on here. That's why it looks like that. But um, with the with the bun, I'm gonna say bun because I'm Haitian. This is what we call it. So, you know, y'all improvise. Um, I'm gonna be using the Creole seasoning. You can use anything: salt, adobo, um, sazon, whatever. But I don't know the Creole seasoning. It be hit. I don't know. To me, the Creole se seasoning be it. So I just throw Creole seasoning on here. All right, I got my two plantains in here. Listen, I want to cook my buffalo chicken wraps tomorrow, but I'm so lazy. I'm so tired. Mm. I'm going to, I'll probably marinate it after I eat. I don't know. I don't know why I'm saying that because you know when after you eat something, you know you ain't getting up to cook nothing and marinate. We're going to see. We're going we gonna to see. We're going we to see. 
Okay, these are about done. And I'm mad. I forgot to put butter on this. So we're about to put some butter on here. Uh -uh. I need some butter. I got my butter on all of them. Y'all. Oh, it's the hooray. It's my birthday. But then again, it's my birthday month. So I could drink out of my birthday cup all month. <laughs> y'all, do y'all see this? Like, oh, I need y'all to see my face. I need y'all to see my face. I'm about to tear this food up. Y'all don't even know. Y'all don't even know. Mm. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. I'm about to try to make me a little like a little sandwich. Sandwich, aka sandwich. But I'm gonna put my asparagus on top. Do y'all see that? Do y'all do y'all see? Do you see my masterpiece? Let me see if I could actually put that all in my mouth. <laughs> but I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go because this food is too good i'm gonna go ahead and watch my show as i eat and i'll talk to you when i'm done i just want to let y'all know that hold on hold on in real time i finished this plate in like 2.2 .2 seconds It was busting no like i really don't be cooking like that but i was like you know what i'm pretty boring like what am i gonna do my vlogs about and i'm like you know what i'm not can't just be talking about hair because i got hair videos but let me just you know cook something because like i was telling you earlier i really need to eat better and you know now i'm like these vlogs are gonna hold me accountable y'all gonna hold me accountable for eating better but i ain't always gonna be eating better but i just need to eat period but anyways that right there, mad good, mad good. Mm. Ooh, I got the itis now, and I really thought I was gonna go. I really thought I was gonna sit here and marinate that chicken. We gonna see. You know what? I'm not even gonna keep saying we're gonna see. We're. I'm not making that chicken till tomorrow. I'm not marinating that chicken until tomorrow morning. And then I'll see how I feel if I want to cook it tomorrow or the following day because I made four tilapias and um, I could eat tilapia again for dinner tomorrow. But I did promise my cousin that I was going to make some buffalo chicken wraps and then I wanted to make some jerk chicken. And um, I'm so tired, but I need to clean up the kitchen and put my pajamas on and and enjoy the rest of the night. So I will probably see you guys tomorrow. Bye. I find this to be hilarious. I go and get my mail one day and I realize that someone left their bike outside and I'm like, wait, did this bike fall off your car, your truck? Did you just drop it off? Are you just like, hey, you know, this seems to be a nice house. Let me go ahead and, you know, gift them a bike. But like, come get your bike. Whose bike is this? Why is it still at my house? Whose bike is this, dog? It's been sitting here for two, two days now, three days. The owner still ain't come get it, and it better be a good bike, cause shoot, let me find out. I must be riding some bikes, y'all, because who bike is this? Who bike? Who bike is this? Come get your bike. I'm just mad that I had to get a freaking bump right in the middle, like really in the middle of my head, though. But anyways. I'm sorry, I have a low-key cold right now. But anyways, this is my fresh rate tools. Look at it. It looks so good. I did a phenomenal job, to be honest. And I'm not trying to, like, boast my head up. Like, I really did because, wow. The products that I used, very happy with them. This lock looks hilarious. I love how it's, like, 
mad bungee and thick right here. Um, but anyways, I bought some products that I wanted to go over with you. So I got one of these numbers um, to be able to oil my scalp. But then I got this one too, because I was like, oh, now nah, this is where it's at. And it's so cool because it can release it in several what do you call these things i don't remember whatever these things are oh excuse me when my hair is at least one month not locked like just sitting there looking crazy and my old my scalp needs to be oiled this is where this will come to play i did end up getting this shampoo um this is the Jamaican mango and lime tingle shampoo. I also bought another one. I don't know if I told you guys that on camera. Let me see if I could find that. Um, if I can open the shower door, that would be great. Okay, so this is it. This is the Shea Moisture, Manuka Honey, and Mafirma Oil. It's the same oils in here, I believe. Oh, no. They both have Manuka Honey, but this one has Mafura Oil. And then this one has the Moringa Seed Oil. But anyways, I got both those shampoos because I realized that I'm kind of not feeling the, um, the Dr. Bronner shampoo. I don't know. I think, like, for me, it's not, there's, no, there's nothing wrong with it. I just personally like to see the suds when I'm washing my hair and it barely gets sudsy and it just, it's giving me the impression that it's not washing my hair the way I want it to. So yeah, that's that. And then I got this. It's supposed to be a satin lined sleep cap. I got all of these items also from Sally's except for this one. I bought it from Walgreens another day before. Let me go ahead and put the set and cap. Let me see what it's working with. Let's see. Sorry, my um my stand, my tripod is somewhere and ain't nobody got time for that. I just wanted to see what this looks like. This wait, hold up, hold up. <laughs> wait a minute. What the hell? <laughs> Dog. I look like <laughs> I look like a baby that was just born. <laughs> what? Yo. If you are married or you got a man, how am I supposed to show up looking like this? I look like I got an old granny underwear on my head. <laughs> Nah, man. Protects hairstyle overnight, but you gonna be cute? Like, y'all. I look like a gift wrapping paper. <laughs> but you know what? I'm gonna try it out. I may look crazy. I'm just gonna put my side. Look. I'm gonna put this right under. I'm gonna be over. I'm gonna put this right over it because I can't be caught with that thing on my head. What? You crazy. I'm going to put this over. And I'm going to try it out. I'm going to see how good it is. But yo, that is one of the ugliest things. Like scarves, bonnets, all of that in general that I ever bought. That is just disgusting. Oh my gosh. That was so ugly. I can't even tell. <laughs> but anyways, those are all the products that I bought. Um. So yeah. I I feel like this vlog is like kind of all over the Okay, I'm over here hurting myself. Sorry my lips is ashy, but whatever. Anyways, um I feel like this vlog is like all over the place. And I apologize. I'm still trying to get, you know, still trying to get it together and figure out like, okay, how to vlog number one. And I need to look into the camera. See, I'm still working on that. But um, I need to learn how to vlog, what to even vlog about, and what y'all want me to even vlog about, you know? So, 
bear with me y'all bear with me um i know i talked about recap i know i talked about the chicken um barbecue no i'll supposed to be making that um buffalo chicken wrap made it forgot to record um jerk chicken my mom ended up stealing my chicken so i finally redid i just marinated the meat and mind you i told you that like two weeks ago yeah two weeks ago was when i first started this vlog on mess but anyways um yeah so I need to make my jerk chicken maybe in two days because I like to have my I don't know if it's just me but do y'all like to just like leave your chicken marinating like I hate marinating my meat and cooking it the same day it just it don't seem like it just sticks to the meat I feel like it just slides off and I need it to penetrate my meat you know what I mean Say hello to my jerk. Mm, 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 mm. But so yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Um, so yeah, and leave my leave comments below and like tell me if you like this or not. Like be real because I don't know y'all. I don't know. Um, I enjoy I enjoy vlogging though. I'll tell you that. I just gotta remember to like pick up the camera. Um. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.